Ja, Freunde der Spiegeltour, wir starten mit Return to Monkey Island. Passend am Tag, an dem man wie ein Pirat reden soll. Also es ist ja Tag des äh, Reden wie ein Pirat heute. Ähm, releasen die das neue Monkey Island, was ja eigentlich Return to Monkey Island heißt und was nicht nur eigentlich heißt, sondern was eigentlich auch der offizielle dritte Teil ist vom eigentlichen Erfinder von Monkey Island. Wer sich äh, wundert damals, wer das, die Geschichte nicht kennt, ähm, das war ja Gilbert. Jetzt fällt mir der Feuer mit Ron Gilbert, ne? Ich bin jetzt nicht 100% sicher, auf jeden Fall hat sich der eigentliche Chef von Monkey Island ja eigentlich zerstritten mit Lukas Arts und die haben die Reihe einfach ohne ihn weitergemacht. Und er selbst wurde von diesem Projekt dann ausgeschlossen. Deshalb ist eigentlich ab Monkey Island 3 das gar nicht mehr im Sinne von, äh, von ihm gewesen. Und er hat gesagt, er wird nie wieder ein Monkey Island machen. Und hat Gott sei Dank damit gebrochen. Und hat mit Developer Digital äh, die Chance bekommen, die letzten Jahre heimlich ein neues Monkey Island zu machen. Ähm, was hoffentlich auch ganz cool ist. Was ich jetzt gerade schon gesehen habe, es gibt ein Sammelalbum, was übrigens die Geschichte der ersten beiden Teile erzählt. Wir können da mal ganz kurz reinklicken. Ich habe es noch nicht so ganz genau angeguckt. Ich habe nur ganz kurz angeklickt und weil es gab eine Info am Anfang, als ich das Spiel gestartet habe und sie hat gesagt, guck dir das Sammelalbum an. Da erfährst du alles, falls du vergessen hast, was überhaupt passiert ist. Hey, want to see my mighty pirate scrapbook? It's filled with my adventures. Ever since I was a kid, I wanted to be a mighty pirate. In the old days, you became a pirate by completing three trials to prove your worth. <laughs> Treasure hunting is important for any pirate. The pirate leaders were in charge of the three trials, acting as judge, jury, executioner, and devoted grog tasters. The test of thievery involved breaking into the governor's mansion. The security was heavy. This is when I met Elaine, the love of my life. She was governor at the time. Mastering sword fighting was more a matter of wits than agility. Things took an unexpected turn while I was working on the three trials. LeChuck thought he was in love with Elaine. <laughs> My first ship was the Sea Monkey. I bought it at Stan's used ships with a letter of credit that I, um, sort of falsified. I scraped together a crew. Carla, Otis, and Meat Hook joined me on my voyage to Monkey Island to save Elaine. Elaine was kidnapped and taken to Monkey Island by the nefarious ghost pirate LeChuck. Monkey Island was a steaming volcanic mystery, covered with jungle and not found on any map. The monkey head opened with a special key that you stuck in its ear. Ein Q-Tip. Moment, auf der Seite fehlt der, äh, der Totenschädel, der mich zur, zum Geisterschiff geführt hat. LeChuck's ghostly ship was anchored in a lake of lava, hidden beneath the island's Aber surface. Aber scheinbar das nicht so wichtig. On the island was a gigantic monkey head statue, with hidden catacombs underneath. I met an old castaway there, Herman Toothrot. He and the locals wrote a lot of indignant letters to each other. We wound up back on Melee Island for the stunning conclusion to my first big adventure. Ja, indem wir nämlich äh, Affen in das Hochzeitskleid von Elaine to the gesteckt haben. Just in time to stop the wedding. Or so I thought. Das hat Elaine, glaube ich, selbst gemacht. Elaine already under control. How does she do that? I defeated LeChuck and he basically exploded. It was the beginning of something magical. Ah, uh, these are from the time I went to find the treasure of Big Whoop. Again, it came down to just me and LeChuck at the end. He was <laughs> using magic, but then, so was I. Elaine always seems to know when I need her. One time, Elaine got turned into a statue. Well, LeChuck was behind it, of course. That guy never gives up. It was around this time that I met Murray, the allegedly all-powerful demonic skull, after a rousing sea battle. This was a great day. Though in retrospect, we shouldn't have had the scum bar handle the catering. I don't know why you have to have candy-coated almonds at a wedding, but apparently you do. Oh man, this was that crazy time LeChuck teamed up with an Australian billionaire and tried to use a mystical talisman to make Elaine his bride. Then there was the time I accidentally let loose LeChuck's pox over the entire Caribbean, or so it seemed. Oh, here's that voodoo doll from the end of my Big Whoop adventure. Ja, die Voodoo Puppe, die wir zusammenbasteln muss am Ende vom zweiten Teil. Notiz an mich selbst: Mehr Papier für den Rest meiner Abenteuer besorgen. 
Oh, das war ein kurzer Überblick zu den Monkey Island 1 und 2. Eigentlich ein sehr schönes Gimmick. Wobei ich gerade sehe, äh... Also der dritte Teil wird komplett ignoriert, ja natürlich. Der dritte Teil ist nicht mehr unter seiner äh, Schirmhaft produziert worden, wurde jetzt im Chat schon gesagt. Und deshalb ist er natürlich auch im Sammelalbum nicht drin. Weil er war nur im Teil 1 und 2, also der Finder von Monkey Island, beteiligt. Und den dritten Teil hat ja Lucas Arts dann damals auf eigene Faust gemacht. Ähm, eigentlich ohne den Segen des Entwicklers. Also des Erfinders. Aber die Rechte waren halt inzwischen. Weil es war damals, man kann sich darüber online äh, einlesen, es war halt schon eine ziemlich... Nummer, die gelaufen ist. Monkey Island 3 war trotzdem ein sehr gutes Spiel damals, als äh, vom Adventure-Größen her, weil Lukas Ars das einfach auch drauf hatte. Aber es ist eigentlich nicht das, was äh, sich der Macher so richtig vorgestellt hat. Und da war auch sehr viel Clinch zwischen ihm und Lukas Ars, weshalb natürlich dieses Spiel niemals unter äh, Lukas Ars Label hätte jemals produziert werden können. So, gucken wir mal, wie das Ganze anfängt, weil es gab eigentlich kaum Informationen über die Story. Es gab natürlich den Anteaser. Äh, Leute haben sich über den Grafikstil aufgeregt, was natürlich immer so eine Sache ist. Grafik ist eigentlich irrelevant, wenn das Adventure gut ist. Und jetzt starten wir. Äh. Will ich den schweren Modus? Ich will den schweren Modus. Das ist übrigens auch klassisch von Monkey Island. Man, man hatte ja den einfach und den schweren Modus. Wodurch die Rätsel äh, mehr wurden. Wer weiß, ob die Wege schwerer werden. Wir werden es erleben. Anything. Just put my leg back on. Hey, you kids. You're not supposed to be in here. <laughs> <laughs> What's next? Let's goof on those two. Pretend they're our parents. <laughs> yeah! Sorry we ran off. You were probably worried about murderers and ne'er-do-wells. Don't worry. I found him. <laughs> <laughs> um, come on, let's go. Let's pretend I have powers that make lightning come out of my eyes. It's so lifelike. I wonder if it's real. Sorry, boys, could you stop following us? It's creepy. Yes, yes sir. sir. Come on, I saw a scurvy dog shack back there. Scurvy dogs? I've never had one of those. No way, you have to try one. It's the best thing you'll ever eat in your life. No fooling. Wow. In this hammer, it started with me, so wie. Also der Teil 2 endet, da ist ja auch, dass du als Kind mit den Chuck plötzlich da bist und seit in diesem Park rauskommst. Meine To-Do-Liste. Scurvy Ducks kaufen. Hey, Chucky, get ready to run. Hm. I guess they don't like visitors. Let's go next door and get Scurvy Dogs. Wakey, wakey, Mr. Pirate! Um... Hello? Boom! Ha! Ah, he's dead to the world! Ah, sounds real! <laughs> Some place. Hey, uh, Chucky! Stand over here for a minute? Nah, I want to get scurvy dogs. Exhibit removed. Aww. <laughs> let's not go back there again. We'll just get yelled at. Yeah, let's get scurvy dogs instead. I'm hungry. Wenn man natürlich merkt, es gibt keine deutsche Sprachausgabe. Hat natürlich auch was mit dem Budget zu tun. Das dafür kostet es halt auch nur 22 Euro, glaube ich, auf Steam. Ähm, I once had the hiccups for four days straight. Aber alle Texte sind halt auch im Deutschen übersetzt. Genauso, ja, ist der ganze Oberfläche ist natürlich deutsch übersetzt, aber es gibt halt eine deutsche Sprachausgabe. Dafür sind die englischen Sprecher teilweise die Originalen. It's locked. 
Maybe one of the shops has a key. Das ist für das Plumsklo finden. The words don't look like words, but there's a picture of a scurvy dog. They put it on a leg to keep you from walking off with it. <laughs> Did you know you can keep a scurvy? They put it on a leg to keep you from walking off with it. <laughs> I'll bring this right back, sir. You'd be wise to do that. I got the leg from the last kid who didn't bring back the key. <laughs> it says, return outhouse key when finished, or else. Those glasses are thicker than the layer of grease on the floor. <laughs> You kids better have money. Uh, yeah, we've got all kinds of money. Can we get a mug of grog, please? Can we get a mug of grog, please? Grogs for grown-ups, beat it! Mich stört das hier gar nicht so sehr. It's locked. Good thing I've got the key in my pocket. Good, you unlocked it. Ich bin gar nicht so unpassend. Ugh, what is this stuff? It smells the same as the toilet. Chucky, why don't you look in the toilet? <lacht> no way. You do it. Ih, da läuft okay. was. Gross. Gross. Richtig, es ist ein Stil, was der Chat auch sagt. Es ist ein Stil und das ist Punkt. Und ich finde den sehr, an sich finde ich den insgesamt sehr stimmig. Weil er, er muss natürlich in dem Guss passen. Klar, Monkey in 3 sah halt irgendwie schon realistischer aus. Und jetzt geht es halt wieder in Richtung stärker Comic-Stil, ne? Gross. It isn't a piece of eight. But it's a round piece of metal about the same size and shape as a piece of eight. That's called a slug. It's like a fake coin. A fake coin is almost as good as a real coin. <laughs> <laughs> What should we do next? We gotta get to scurvy dogs. I, I can't believe you never had one. I can't even tell if it's animal, vegetable, or mineral. Please wash hands before leaving outhouse. In France, they call a scurvy dog a chien scorbut. I'm not touching that gunk. It seems more like something Chucky would do. Ah, mit Tap hat man einen Overlayer, äh, wo man sehen kann, was, womit man interagieren kann. Chucky ist Le Chuck. Nur als Kind. That's where the outhouse key was. Now what? Can we get a couple of scurvy dogs? Sure. If you give me a piece of eight, that's money that grown-ups use. I know what a piece of eight is. Good for you. You can have a couple of dogs if you give me one. Okay, ich muss also die äh, Metallmünze einfärben. It looks like a piece of eight, if you don't see very well. Oder seine Brille verschwinden lassen. Ich mache sich so lange über seine Brille lustig, bis er die absetzt. Those glasses are thicker than the layer of grease on the floor. Oder auch nicht, oder ich muss sie einfach verschwinden lassen. I don't see very well, but I can hear just fine. Those glasses are thicker than the layer of grease on the floor. Oh, ich muss es einfach versuchen. What can we get with this? Tastes like a piece of eight. Enough for a couple of scurvy dogs if you want. Das ist einfach als gedacht. Take them, boy. What are you getting? What? Just kidding. Here's yours. Uh, 
This is the perfect food. What do you want to do now? I don't know. What do you want to do? I wonder where those two people we were following went. I can stand on my head without using my hands. This would be great for Apple Bobby. Lass uns einfach in diese Richtung gehen. That's my friend D. Hey D. Hey Chucky. What are you jerk faces up to? We just got here. I'm making a list of stuff to do. Give me that. I'm an expert planner. There. Perfect. See you around the park, Sid Heads. Herumalbern und erkunden den Anker an, den Schacke in einem Rennen schlagen, die Ente füttern, etwas Soße zu meinem Scarby Dog hinzufügen, Schwertkampf üben, ein vierblättriges Kleeblatt finden, sich etwas am Wunschbrunnen wünschen, unsere echten Eltern finden. Irgendwann. That's a cool anchor. That just shows how little you know about anchors. This one's not a very good example. You'd know that if you read as much about anchors as I have. Did you know that anchors originally weren't designed to hold ships in place? They were used in combat, shot from cannons as a grapple when you were trying to board another ship. They started making them bigger and bigger because they would do more damage that way. So long, I then people notice what happened when you miss the other ship and hit the sea bottom instead. The current bow-shaped design is actually less effective than the sharper V-shaped design that was popular last century. But the older design went out of fashion after sailors started to think the letter V. You can still find the old kind around sometimes, but collectors have grabbed on a modern anchor. If you look close, you can tell that one side is all that's to prevent what's called plummeting. When the anchor goes, the little flanges at the tips are at different angles to make it tw Most anchors these days are made of iron. About the all kinds, but the only way the word anchor, they're called that because, yeah, I <laughs> Ich habe uns ein bisschen Zeit gespart. Aha, drücke äh, Komma, um alte Zeilen zu lesen, die gerade gelaufen sind. Das hast du gut gemacht, äh, Lil Chuck. Hey Chucky, wanna race? You're on. I'll officiate. Three, two, one, go! Chucky wins! Woohoo! Yeah! Darn! Muss nur schneller klicken. You up for another race? You're on. I'll officiate. Three, two, one, go! I win! <laughs> <laughs> extra tooth in the back. I can feel it with my tongue. The end of the turn. Hey, hands off. I want to feed the duck. Did you know your feet won't smell if you don't wash them? Excuse me. Yes. Could we, we have, have some of your bread to feed the duck? I don't think so. We brought it for ourselves. Aber es liegt doch schon auf dem Boden. Excuse me. Yes. Will you pretend to be our parents again? What do you mean, again? Go along and find your real parents. Excuse me. Yes. Could we have some of your bread to feed the duck? I don't think so. We brought it for ourselves. Ich habe natürlich immer das Gefühl, man müsste ja zum Erfolg kommen, wenn man einfach häufiger fragt. Weil das halt in dem Monkey Island auch funktioniert hat. What's this red glob on the ground? That's ketchup. It's supposed to be really good with scurvy dogs. You should put that on your scurvy dog. Kinder sind echt eklig. Let's find out. 
What do you think you're doing? Kids these days, you have no regard for personal property. And no respect for your elders. I have half a mind to give you a piece of my mind. And I've got the other half. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, <laughs> blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah,
Having fun? <laughs> yeah! We got scurvy dogs! Those have toenails and stuff in them. Ugh, I read about it. And we were playing your adventures! We just did Big Whoop! Big Whoop? Oh boy, that takes me back. I like it when Chucky asked me to put his leg back on. He says it really funny. You guys always make up the craziest stuff for the ending of that story. It's fun! But you can't just change it around. That's not how storytelling works. A lot of your stories don't feel like they're finished at the end. What do you mean? Well, like, there's this one that you call The Secret of Monkey Island, where you went to Monkey Island and fought LeChuck. Oh, that story has a great ending. There's punching and fireworks. I thought you liked that one. But you never did find the secret. Not the real one. Sure, but that's not what that story was about. Kids, let me tell you a story that is about finding the secret of Monkey Island. Is this a long story? I think maybe I gotta go use the bathroom or something. Yeah, I have to go um, walk my tarantula. Maybe I should go with them. No, no, stick around. This is a good one. <laughs> See, there was a rumor going around that my old nemesis, LeChuck, had somehow discovered the exact location of the secret of Monkey Island. I knew I had to get it before he did, so I went to Melee to get my own expedition started and beat him to the punch. Oh, ist das nostalgisch, ey. Genauso wie Teil 1 wäre am Anfang. von Ron Gilbert. Dave Grossman hat mich übrigens noch heute gefollowt auf Twitter. Eine Ehre. nur empfehlen, ähm, die Remakes zu spielen. Also die Special Editions sind Bombe, fand ich. Wobei die Original kann man heute sich immer noch angucken, finde ich. Ich finde, das sieht immer noch nicht schrecklich aus. Sie sind irgendwie, klar, es sieht halt Asbach aus, aber es ist halt irgendwie gut gehalten trotzdem. Nennen wir was der Animator-Künstler, der mir gefolgt ist, oder der nette weiter her, aber nicht der Ron. Richtig, man kann in, in, den, äh, in, den, in den Special Editions kann man umschalten in die Originalgrafik oder die neuere Version nehmen. Obwohl ich finde auch die neue Grafik jetzt nicht schlecht von den Remakes. Die haben wir ja damals auch gespielt. Ah, feels good to be back on Melee Island, the hub of pirating in the Caribbean, where every good expedition begins. I'll see some old pals and get things rolling. Or sailing in this case. Hi, I'm Guybrush Threepwood. Remember me? Haven't seen you in a while, Threepwood. What have you been up to? Oh, you know, freebooting mostly. Swashing buckles and so on. But now I'm getting an expedition together to find the secret of Monkey Island. Oh, you're sailing with LeChuck. What? LeChuck's here in Melee? Is there widespread panic? Are people evacuating? Ah, he doesn't seem interested in carnage at the moment. Ship's just here taking on supplies and crew, as far as I can tell. Anyway, no, I'm not sailing with LeChuck. You know my history with him? Wir waren während meiner gesamten Karriere Feinde. Der Typ klaut mir all meine besten Ideen. He steals all my best ideas. Are you sure it isn't the other way around? Seems like he was here first. I don't know how he found out, but I'm sure he's just doing this to get one up on me. Hat meine Frau entführt. The Chuck kidnapped my wife. He's always had designs on her. I sailed to Monkey Island to find them and get her back. Oh, I thought you weren't married yet when that happened. And didn't she more or less rescue herself? That's not the point. <laughs> Ein böser Zombie-Pirat, der Schrecken der Meere. He's an evil zombie ghost pirate, terror of the seas, and sometimes the land. A nefarious, conniving, murdering scallywag. A depraved, ruthless villain. 
and a loud talker. And I'm not those things. They say opposites attract, but what do I know? We've been enemies for my whole career. Everywhere I go, there he is. He plagues me. He's my nemesis. Funny. He said the same thing about you. <laughs> Ich organisiere meine eigene Reise. I'm mounting my own voyage. Mine. Well, you'd better get cracking then. The chuck's loading up on the outer dock as we speak. Well, I'm gonna hire a ship and a crew and beat him to the punch. Just as soon as I can get someone to back the venture. I'm a little short on funds at the moment. In that case, you'll want to go talk to the pirate leaders at the scum bar. Exactly. <laughs> That's why I came to Melee. It'll be great to see those old guys again. We'll knock back a grog and hash out the details. Scum bar by the docks. Long table in the back. I know where I'm going. We'll see. Ja, wir werden sehen, ob ich weiß, wo ich hin muss. I detect a certain resemblance here. Yes, it looks a lot like an owl, doesn't it? Hi there, little guy. Hi. Hi there, little guy. Boah, echt ey, Nostalgiekeule, komm raus. Reelect Governor Carla. She's tough on toughness. Und Leschak belegt wirklich sein Schiff schon. Ach so, spreche ihn noch mal an. Am Ausguck. I just came from up there. I really need to talk with the pirates. Oh nein, ich darf nicht zurück. Danke, Sarulon, für einen Tier 3 Sub. Vielen Dank. I'll talk to the pirate leaders before I go see what LeChuck is up to. I'm here to talk to the pirate leaders about a new expedition. In the back. I'm here to talk to the pirate leaders about a new expedition. In the back. It's a book for storing collectible trivia cards. Looks like someone just left it here unattended. Alles mitnehmen. Im hinteren Teil der Scamba. Äh, der Kellner. Eine Angeltrophäe. Die Küche. Ein riesiger Wal. Like eine mal die Küche. Ich hatte nicht gehört, dass es einen Führungswechsel gab. I hadn't heard there was a change of leadership. Oh no. Did nobody remember to notify you? Maybe your party invite got lost in the mail. Wo sind die drei älteren Herren, die hier immer Hofgehalten haben? Where are the guys who used to hold court here? Who cares? Probably crying in an alley somewhere, wishing they were still relevant. Making up trials for each other and writing memoirs that no one will read. Is it you I should talk to about financing an expedition? An expedition? Who is it that you think you are exactly? Ich bin die Grundsolide Investition, auf die ihr gewartet habt. I'm the rock solid investment you've been waiting for. Spare me the greasy sales pitch. Permission to slaughter the annoying old wastrel man, Captain Madison. Wait, it was Captain Madison? She's like famous. I've got her on a trading card. Her plunder stats are amazing. Plunder stats aren't everything. Then the others were Captain Lila and Captain Trent. It was Lila who threatened to kill you? Look, they weren't that great, okay? Listen to the story. Want me to slaughter him? Don't bother. He's just a harmless hack who thinks he has a good idea for a pirate raid. It's not exactly a raid. What else would we be interested in? I'm 
going to find the secret of Monkey Island. You're wasting our time. The secret? I didn't think that was even a real thing. It's a personal passion of mine. I really want to find it. Your weird fetishes are not something I need to hear about. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'm sensing some reluctance, but hear me out. <laughs> Would you at least consider advancing me some funds? It's a surefire investment. Triple your money or your money back. Not interested. I could make it worth your while to help me hire a crew. The percentage of their earnings or something? No one in here wants to chase your pipe dream. you at least point me towards an available ship? You don't even have a ship. You're really up a creek. Up a creek without a ship. <laughs> if you don't take this opportunity, LeChuck will grab it. LeChuck? Yes, the dreaded zombie ghost pirate LeChuck himself is also going after the secret. He's here in Melee getting ready right now. If that doesn't prove it's a worthwhile venture, I don't know what else to tell you. Great, problem solved. Excellent, you'll do it. No, of course not. Why waste money on an expedition when you can just join the one that's already going? Have fun with your scary ghost friend. Bye-bye. Well, the slight problem with that idea is that LeChuck and I are basically mortal enemies. <laughs> 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 Fine. I don't need you or your money. I can do this on my own. If I can't buy a ship, I'll steal one. I'm a pirate. I'll find a way to get to Monkey Island no matter what it takes. Uh, I like the old pirate leaders better. <laughs>